previously on Control. The pillar found at the crossroads is best described as an onyx spike that protrudes from the cave floor like an imposing stalagmite. <laughs> They have this. Here are the facts. A considerable, considerably large section of the containment sector, including the processes and protocols offices, our research facilities, and a fair chunk of the firebreak has been yanked down to a chasm that reaches far below lobby level. We have another letter from a listener. This one's unsigned, but postmarked from Toledo. That looks like soap or mold. We deal. We do deal with the mysterious Federal Bureau of Control, who exists in a strange, uh, otherworldly skyscraper located in the center of New York City that no one has ever seen, and that no one can see because of a strange perception filter that's around it. Recap over. Q transition. Why is it blue? Why is this place blue? Oh no, the camera's loose. Shit. Okay, well, looks like I'm gonna have to- looks like I'm gonna have to cleanse you. How the hell did it get out? It's been affected by the hiss. Get out of there, hiss! Whoa! Jesse Faden soaring in swift platform. Oh, so this is the, this is the part of the cleansing. Synth wave. I like the music. Some total. This is some total recall. Cyberpunk 27 stuff going on here. All that Miami aesthetic, man. The color palette and the soundtrack and everything. Oh, okay, that was close. Okay, come on, baby. What else we got? What else we got? He's a level two, it's fine. Hey, you! Be my friend! This is a real good jam, isn't it, Hans? I have to concentrate here. Don't mind me. Oh, well, there goes that platform. Uh, not to be the bearer of bad news, but I think there's another platform coming. There's another big thing coming. Yeah, there's another wall coming. Oh, dear. Oh, I dodged it. Oh, God, I dodged it. <laughs> Hold on, I see his over there. Here, have this. Whoops. I have to put down the body. Oh, look at this tunnel. I like this. This is groovy. You could lose me, huh? Hey, it's the camera. I just, I just need to get this thing low enough. Come here, you. Uh, mine now, clown. Uh. Okay, it's not done yet. It's not done yet. This is fun. This is really fun. All the tension that all the tension that I was feeling in the previous uh, in the previous levels is gone now. Oh, get me closer so I can eat something at it. Oh, oh, well, bye. Flat. <laughs> yeah. That was great. <laughs> yeah, I'm on these rocks.
Hey, be my friend. Ah. Oh, well, I'm dead. Dang it. I should not have walked backwards. Oh, uh, looks like I've got an assignment to go on, and that's to cleanse that freaking camera. <laughs> Oh no! I fell off again! Ah! Shark! Ah! Oh, darn it! Ah! Oh, I got hit in the face by a rocket! No! <laughs> Come on, pal. No! My shield didn't come back. Oh no, I fell off the tracks again. Oh my god. Come on. I got all day, baby. I got as many reels of film and as many takes as it'll need uh, as we'll need to make this movie a success. It's gonna be number one at the box office, I can feel it. No bueno, no bueno. Okay. Yep, here comes, uh, here comes part number. Here comes enemy section of enemies number one. There goes that guy. And out he goes. <laughs> that was fun. Oh, oh shit. I forgot that platform is supposed to explode like that. Okay. Actually, no, no. I'm gonna... Make, ensure my own safety first. I think I wiped both of them out, yeah. They're all dead now. Awesome. And now we wait, because this is now Act 2, and the camera's coming out for, uh, for another show of force. Come on, camera. Relinquish thyself to me. I am your... Well, I'm not your maker, but I am your fa... I am your... I can't think of a good one-liner. I'll... I'll... We'll, we'll, it's bad read. Bad read. We'll, we'll, we'll think of something of it. We'll think of something later.
I wonder if I can murder this guy before he reaches me. Never mind, I think I missed him twice. Oh, there he goes. Oh, and end up straight. Thank you very much for the lurk. Nice to have you on the stream as well. Hope you're having a good day. Oh, I deleted him. Nice. Alright, time for Act 3, big boss. Okay, I'm just gonna grab a rock and wait. There he is. Yep, I'm doing good damage to him with this. I missed. I don't know where he is. Uh oh. Okay, where is he? There he goes! Hey, <laughs> I got him! Hi, Cocky. I mean, he's gonna just shoulder charge me the whole time and just try to melee me. I mean, I don't... I mean... He does what he wants, I guess. Come on, camera. Relinquish thyself. Give in to me. I am your... Damn it, I am I am the director now. Yes. Yes. That's it. Did it! Yeah, took my tries. Awesome! Wait, what? We're back? Did that really just happen? It felt like a dream. Or maybe a bad movie. Definitely a bad movie. Yay! Uh, I wonder what's over this. Is it just a door? Yeah, it's just a door. Awesome! That was an awesome side mission. <laughs> Amazing. I, I I really want to know what the. Uh, I actually really wanted to know what the uh, movie camera does, but um, unfortunately, I haven't found the document that tells me what it does yet. <laughs> okay, so progress. Uh, we know what's in there already. It's a mold zombie that is now dead. Uh, bathrooms are covered with rocks. So now we need to head to this fire break. And maybe this is the one with the, maybe this is the one with the cat. Excuse me. Or not. Nope. A damn gun. Fate. Not sure she's ready. I'm here, aren't I? Huh. I saved the bureau once, and I'll do it again. Oh, let's have, oh, yep, there we go. I've served under two directors. Three now, I suppose. Trench and I worked our way up together. We made it through the tough cases, the bad days, the casualties. He was the epitome of a good agent. Smart, decisive, selfless. Then he picked up that damn gun. Becoming director is a formal process overseen by the board. Lots of ritual and mystery. After that, key staff provide detailed briefs on all classified matters. Past and present. But with Faden... Well, there's no protocol for field promotion. The girl's smart, has a good head on her shoulders. I'm trusting her to handle the hiss upstairs, while I hold them off here. All this shit with the nail, the board, I'm not sure she's ready. Besides, I work better alone. 
Well, I mean, it's pretty obvious that since you're talking to us from the hotline, something happened to you. Helen Marshall, something happened that put you in direct contact with the with the hotline, which means you're either dead or somewhere else. Oh, movie camera procedures. Yay! An action max camera. This item should be isolated from any person or event that is objectively interesting since its effect is activated by the process of dramatic. A movie camera used to make commercial feature films. Internal mechanisms are unremarkable. Subjects near the film will often experience a torqued version of reality, resembling the heightened drama and action of a movie. Whether these events are localized alternate realities or products of hallucination is currently unknown. Additionally, the item seems to record footage from these incidents and creates VHS copies ed edited in the style of short films. Uh, background to the investigation, agents learned that the podcast titled Brian's Movie Den had reviewed the item-generated movie Bel Delivery Disaster. Uh, the podcast creator, Brian Hennerman, was taken for questioning. The staff of Movie Night, the store Mr. Hennerman rented the film from, are also questioned to no effect. So the camera basically creates films from the, I guess it creates films from the imaginations of creative people, like artsy types that stand next to the camera, and then uh, creates copies of that as short films in VHS, which is pretty cool. That's uh, actually a pretty interesting SCP, uh, like a SCP slash all set item idea. It's kind of benign, kind of not, but uh, we're back in the, we're back in the spooky bits now. Oh, hello. This is another one of those. Another etching, like the one I used to get in here. Oh, there's another chamber past here. Hold on. Let me, let me put my hand on this thing and see what it does. Like a door of some kind. Oh, my ass. Is this the lock slash key the board told me about? Former? What are you doing here? Also, hold on a second. I'm just going to quickly back up a bit because this requires another picture. So I guess I'm supposed to fix this thing? Nope. doing my job oh I don't spin with it that's sad <laughs> ow <laughs> that hurt oops it's not a bit back to reality so first one down director Faden's got this covered so definitely the former has got something to do with this too. Go on, also come back here, ball. It's freaking ball, stop running. Why are you running? Why are you running? Because you know why you're running? Because you're mine now. Oh. Mine. Oh, thanks for ouch. Thanks for waiting. Uh, here. Become my friend. I'm very lonely. Ha ha! And now I have regenerating health, or well, these guys don't. Ha 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 ha! There we go. It's dead. Thanks for, thanks for the heals, bro! Yeah, uh, just follow me for a while while I go and uh, handle other things. You know what I mean? Or stay there. That's fine too. Oh, are you following me? Yeah, you are. Nice. I wish your health was a. I, I wish your health didn't like didn't slowly tick down, but um, that's fine, I guess. We're back here. Oh hey, this. Oh hey, box. Ding. Pokemon ammo refund. Well, I'm sorry, pal, but um, I. I yeah, yeah, you're dead. Uh. Is this generator do anything? Nope. Okay, so... Wait, Emily? Wait, you weren't here, but- Jesse, hey! Emily, how did she get down here? How did you get down here, Emily? What are you doing down here, Emily? What do you mean? You called me down, remember? I'm pretty sure I didn't. No, that's right. You didn't. But then, I remember you needing me to come here. I mean, you even told me how to get in. Let's just chalk it up to synchronicity so we can get to work. She takes everything in stride. The board called me down here to deal with the situation. The astral plane is colliding with our world, I know. Isn't it fascinating? I never even considered that the astral plane could be a, a physical volume expanding beyond its dimensional container. The bleed is localized to this area, but its growth rate seems steady. Given time, 
It will consume the entire Bureau. And possibly beyond. That's what I'm here to stop. The board told me to fix the nail over there by dismantling four locks in the astral plane. Funny, I think it's put itself back together a bit. So that could be due to the law of inverse exchange. For every associated component you remove, this nail reconstructs. Or possibly some variation of anti-sympathy. Don't worry. I'll look into it. Did you notice all the Bureau infrastructure? It looks like there was a research team stationed down here at some point. Do you think Darling knew about this? I'd put money on it. That reminds me. Have you seen Marshall? She contacted me over the hotline, but then I saw her walking around. I haven't seen her. The hotline only connects to extraplanar entities. Or dead people. But Marshall's proved time and time again that she's a survivor. That's exactly what I thought. Anyway, I've been looking into the minerals growing down here. Have you noticed how they insist on maintaining a certain form? Maybe some sort of a, a state memory, or they consciously prefer a certain shape? Or... I think we're on a clock here, Emily. I need to stop the astral bleeding before it brings the oldest house down. See what you can find out from the nail in the meantime. And send out some rangers to look for Marshall. She may be in trouble. Will do, Jesse. If you see anything interesting, remember to take detailed notes. Is it just me or this or did you see like her mouth like cork down this way when she was talking? Um, Jesse, that is. The Rangers have tapped into an old radio oh. network they found around the foundation. So if you need backup, just call them at one of the stations. Oh, ooh. Alright, let's uh let's 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 get some lore binging going on, shall we? How did the hiss get into the foundation? Same way we did, I imagine. But you need to remember that the Hiss are the embodiment of persistence. Their nature seems to be one of force, to find every possible vulnerability and exploit it. Their only goal is consumption. I'm sure there's plenty of goodies for them down here. The nail, for instance. If the Hiss could corrupt the nail, I'm sure they would have by now. It must not interest them in its broken state. They could be distracted by the numerous unknown paranatural materials I'm sure are lying around. These are the roots of the oldest house. The Hiss will find plenty of ways to make trouble. They're pretty good at that. So you've never heard of the Foundation, huh? I've never even seen the name referenced. It, clearly it's highly classified, but for what reason? The problem with these kinds of closed off hidden areas is that they were likely sealed for good reason. But now no one is left to tell us what that reason was. Any guesses why the Bureau would hide something like this? I only know what I've observed. This place is spatially rigid, which means it doesn't shift like the rest of the oldest house. And before you ask why that is, I have to admit that I'm clueless. There's some signal interfering with my equipment, making it hard to get a clear reading. It's being emitted from the floor. Maybe I should have brought a jackhammer. The astral plane is already taking chunks out of this place, Emily. Let's not add to it. So let me get this straight. The astral plane is bleeding into the foundation. Correct. And that's happening because the nail is damaged. I'd say it's a bit more than damaged, but yes, that is my understanding. So what's the connection between the nail and the astral plane? It's a good question. See, I always pictured objects of power as strings between our plane and the astral. If the nail has a similar relationship, then maybe it's more accurate to think of it like plumbing. Now that the nail is busted, sewage is gushing everywhere. Not the prettiest metaphor. Okay, that's all we can talk to her for about now. I should get back out there. Oh, talk to her. Agreed. About the astral bleed won't stop itself. Show. What? 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 what, what?